what is going on everybody uh your boy d here uh it's been a while i've got this cool shiny zamazenta premium figure collection box to open and i am way late on opening this um just because i was on vacation for two weeks and then i got sick after so but we're gonna we're gonna open this up today we're gonna power through even though probably sound really sick and my sound all nasally but I just can't wait to open this I wish I had on I honestly had two of these so I can keep one sealed just because I really like the way this looks let me just give a good view here like just look at that that's so cool it's in the box I am loving it and you get 11 packs of crowns in it so that's pretty cool and as a bonus as a bonus today, I also have this cool pack of Scarlet and Violet, but as you can see, it's Escarlata y Purpura. It's like I was in Spain for two weeks, so I decided to pick up a pack to see if I could get any cool, cool pulls in Spanish. And my girlfriend picked this out for me, so hopefully she picked a good one. Alright, so let's start with that. Let's get that out of the way. So I know it's been a while since I've opened anything up, but just because there hasn't been a lot on the on the market lately. And then I don't know if I'm going to be getting the, the new Scarlet and Violet set, or if I'm just going to pass that and wait for the 151 set, or the set that comes out after Paldea Evolved, just because that looks really good. Ooh. I don't know if you guys saw that, but that, uh, they have an interesting code card. It's purple. I don't think, I don't think they have that. I don't think they have color. I think it's a like green or something. Neat. Neato. Let's get into it. So as I am noticing that the names are the same, but then the the language is obviously different. Which I mean, I understand that it's hard to localize. It's hard to localize names and stuff. Like it's it was much easier to do when there was less Pokemon. But yeah, you can see there's Buizel. I guess Buizel is still Buizel in Spain. Except the trainers, the trainers don't, they get their name. Jacques is now Sinew. Which I suppose is, is what it is. Nice Florigato. Oh, and then we got a Capsa Kid. We have Fue Coco. And the final card is a Professor's Research. And our basic energy. Nice. Okay. So there was that fun out of the way. Now let's get into the prime, the prime draw, the, the main attraction, shiny Zamazenta collection box. So let's just open this bad boy up. Try not to destroy the box, although this is sealed fairly nicely. Oh, well. Try not to wreck both sides. So you never know, I might do something with the... I might do something with the box. Just checking to see if I cut myself on that plastic. Sure. Contents come out. And this is a nice box too. So we will get into this. I can get it open. There we go. Some solid plastic. So you get 
a cool pin, which is actually really cool. I like that. Classic pin style. Yeah, I like that. That's a cool pin. And then we get a cool figure, which is super neat. I'll put it next to my Arceus figure that I got from that Arceus collect figure box. So I wish the paint was a little nicer. You can see the paint defect there. That is what it is. And then here is the shiny Zamazenta. Very nice. Cool. I don't think I have a nice cool Zamazenta V card yet. Let me get these Zacian sleeves. I hope the Zacian box has the shiny Zamazenta sleeves on it. And then what the heck is that down there? Oh no, I get it. Zamazenta's on the bottom. I didn't even see that. Did not even see that. I was like, what the heck is this face on the bottom here? But nope, that's Zamazenta. That's cool. Okay, and now the moment we've been waiting for, the 11 packs of Crown Zenith, Crown Zenith, whatever it is. Will we get anything good? Who knows? Who knows? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Alright, so let's get a rip in here. So what I want to do for the next couple videos is I have another, I have an ETB, a Crown Zenith ETB to open, but I want, I want to compare that to this uh, uh, V-Star Universe. And then after that, I don't know what else, but I have, I know I have that. Trekking Shoes, Lunatone, Soul Rock, Sun and Moon, back to back. Love this. Emolga, Energy Retrieval. Now this is weird, not only with the yellow borders, but uh, just the one reverse. Compared to the Scarlet and Violet Multi-Reverse. Galarian Berserker. That's the rare. And yeah, I think honestly I'm glad that Scarlet and Violet you get a guaranteed hollow and two reverses. It's just a, it makes it more fun. Opening the packs. Let's see, and it's also nice not to have to do the card trick just because these cards are slippy. All right, let's see. Giraffe Rig, Pincurchin, Rescue Carrier. Coughing, Sunkern, Galarian, Mr. Mime, Shinx. Oh, I skipped a card, but that's okay. We have the Latios. That's very nice. Trainer Gallery, Galarian Gallery, and Snorlax as a yarn. Yarny Snorlax as the rare. Alright, pack number three. Numero Trace. So yeah, I was in Spain for two weeks. It was incredible. The weather was so nice. The food was delicious. I can't recommend it enough to anyone who's been thinking about going. Go. You won't regret it. It's expensive, but it is. It is so, so worth. Great ball, Soul Rock, no Lunatone, but we got the trekking shoes, so that was almost like that first pack. Shinx, trying to read, but failing. Galarian Meowth. We got a Raihan signature card, which is neat. And we have an Enamorous as the rare. Enamorous, I know some people don't like it, but I'm not. I, I have no strong feelings one way or the other. It was cool that it was they introduced a brand new Pokemon in Legends Arceus. And, um, yeah, I don't know. I'm not a big 
Cater. The Therian form is kind of weird looking, but um, overall nothing to get too bent out of shape about. And we have Black Pokeball card. Friends in Sinnoh, which is a good card to get if you can get the full art. Gloom, Great Ball, Baltoy, Tangela, Larvesta, Snowrunt, Switch. Wow, okay. Darkrai V Star, Galarian Gallery. That is actually amazing. Definitely one that I wanted. Behind it, we do we got a Hatterene VMAX, which I believe is a different artwork. If we ever got a Hatterene VMAX before, nice little double hit pack there. Wow, that is awesome! Very cool, very cool. There we go, All right? Pack number, I don't even know at this point. I'm visiting a friend today, got back, and I said, you know what, okay, I'm gonna open up some cars to, it's a long weekend this weekend, and is that, do we have another V-Star marker? Look at that. Look at that. Another black Pokeball card. Ultra Ball. Electric. Lost Vacuum, Purloin, Rock Rough, Execute, Cherubi, and we have, ooh, we have a Reverse Hollow Energy, which is nice. And do we get anything at the back? Another Yarny Snorlax. Yarny Snorlax as the, the rare. All right. Oh, so that's again yeah, another nice thing that crowns out does is the reverse hollow energies. Very nice if you can get your hands on a bunch, put them in your deck, bling out. I don't know, I don't think they're that expensive, but they are really nice. They are really nice. Energy. Friends in Sinnoh. The Friends in Hisui is also a very nice card if you can if you can pull it. Uh, I don't know how expensive it is, but I, I can imagine the full art trainers are always kind of kind of pricey. Shanks, Pancham, he'll chop you, and we have Adaman, which I believe I pulled already, but this one's a much nicer quality, I think. Very nice. And what do we get? We got Galarian Berserker as the rare. I think I pulled this already in one of the first Crown Zenith, uh, whoa, Crown Zenith products that are open. What was that? Was that a ETB? That might have been a Pokemon Center ETB. Might have been. But still, very nice. Very nice. I, I, I'm noticing a lot with uh, these pack openings that I keep pulling. Um, full art trainers. Like that's my thing now. I just keep pulling the same full art trainers. V Star Marker. Friends in Hasui. Just talking about that and Adaman. Rescue Carrier. Helioptile. Nuru. Shanks. Pancham. Doing his job. Snowrunt. Pokemon Catcher and ooh, Heliolisk as the rare. Yeah. Yeah, I think these specialty sets, they, uh, with the, the chance of pulling the Galarian Gallery, that extra card in the reverse slot, I like that uh, you get that same feeling from the new Scarlet Violet. You know, it's always fun to pull stuff. And it just I don't know, feels good when your pack isn't empty, so you can feel good that you spent your money and actually got something. You could alternate, alternately just buy singles and you know get what you want every time, but you still get the, the, the fun feeling of pulling something. 
what you can't deny is is fun. That rush. Pan Cham almost have a place in it. Snow run into the Mew Valerian Gallery. That's a nice card. I might have pulled this already, but uh, you know you can't get too, you can't be too disappointed. And a Hollow Entei. And actually, that's a I like that Entei as the Hollow. Uh, yes, yeah, we'll put it back there. Why not? Why not? Electric digging duo. Trap rig, Cheruby, Execute, Rock Rough, Purloin, Love Disc, Rock Rough Reverse Hollow, and Yarny Snorlax. That's a, a common non hollow rare in this box. Conspiracy theory? No, probably not. And I've, I've, I'll say, I've said this, and I'll say it again. I'm glad we don't have non-hollow rares anymore. That's just, I mean, yeah, I don't know. Just a non-hollow rare is so deflating. I'm just glad they're gone. Great ball. Fish sharp. Raveler with no Geodude or Golem, if I recall correctly. That's a cool artwork. Bidoof, Coughing, Solandit, Purloin, Purloin Reverse, and Dragalgy. That's the rare. That's cool. Cool artwork. Final pack. Will we get some last pack magic from the Shiny Zamazenta box. I will have to debate whether or not to get the shiny Zacian box to complete the complete the the, the duo. If if people still have it in stock, maybe I waited too long. All right, let's get some last pack magic here. Soul Rock. Trekking shoes. No Lunatone, so we won't ever recreate that first pack. Cricketot, Chattot, Mr. Mime, Sunkern, oh no, I'm spoiling stuff, Bidoof. And we get, speaking of Bidoof, we get Bidoof from the forest scene, which I don't think I had this, this guy before, so that is awesome. And can we go? No, we can't go to. There's a Luxray, a cool Luxray art for the last non-hollow rare. So let's just quickly gather everything up. We'll do a quick little summary here. We have Bidoof, the Hollow Ente, the Mew Galarian Gallery. We have the Adaman Full Art Trainer, looking good. We have the Darkrai V Star on the lake, just chilling, pondering, meditating. Hatterene V Max, Reverse, or the Hollow Fire Energy, and Latias from the Trainer Gallery. And of course, the Shiny Zamazenta promo for the box. All right, uh, so that's gonna do it for this video. Um, if you wanna leave a comment, let me know what your favorite pull was. Uh, let me know if I should get the shiny Zacian box and open that up. And yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.